In this video, we take a look at the easiest way to convert GPA, or CGPA, to a percentage and convert percentage to GPA. Let's move to my laptop screen and explain it in detail. GPA basically abbreviated as grade point average and CGPA stand for cumulative grade point average. GPA is a number that indicates how well or how high you scored in your courses on average. It's meant to score you during your studies and shows whether your overall grades have been high or low. Now, we discuss how to convert GPA into percentage simplest and easy way. For GPA to percentage conversion, we use a formula, in this formula, the percentage is equal to GPA plus 1 and multiply with 20. Let me explain this concept with the help of a simple example, let's say, our GPA is equal to 3.5, we want to convert our GPA into a percentage. Now we use our GPA to percentage conversion formula. Now, we put GPA number 3.5 in our GPA to percentage conversion formula, when 3.5 plus 1 then we get 4.5. When 4.5 multiply with 20, we get 90%. In this way, we convert GPA into a percentage. Now, you may find your percentage from your GPA number. Now, we take a look, how to convert cumulative grade point average into a percentage easiest way. It is so simple, just take a look. For CGPA to percentage conversion, we need to find the percentage of each semester. Then we find the average of these percentages. Let me explain with the help of an example. Let us have a GPA in semester 1 3 and 3.5 in the second semester. First, we find the GPA of each semester in percentage. First, we convert the GPA of each semester in percentage. Semester 1 GPA convert to percentage is 80%. In the second semester, the GPA converts to a percentage or 90%. Now, we find the average of these two converted GPA percentage. In this case only two semesters, we add 80% and 90% and divide with 2. Here we get 85% CGPA percentage. In this way, we find a CGPA percentage. Now, we take a look, how to convert percentage into GPA? For the conversion of the percentage into GPA, we use our previous formula. If we rearrange our formula, we get GPA is equal to the percentage divide by 20 and less 1 from it. Now, we explain this concept with the help of an example, let we want to convert 90% into GPA. We put the percentage number in a formula when 90 divided by 20, we get 4.5 number, now we need to subtract 1 from 4.5. We will get a 3.5 GPA. If you take notice, we use 3.5 GPA in our first example. Let's say, we have a percentage in semester 1 is 90% and 80% in the second semester. Now, we will put these percentage numbers in our formula. We will get a GPA for each semester. Now, we use our percentage to GPA converter formula. We get a 3.5 GPA in semester 1 and 3 GPA in the second semester. Now, we find the average. We add 3.5 and 3 and divide 2 to get CGPA 3.25 number. In this way, we find the CGPA from percentage. Friends, you may check my GPA and CGPA calculation video in Accounting Plus channel. The link is also available in this video description. It will also helpful for you. Please like, share and subscribe to the Accounting Plus channel. If you have any questions, please feel free to ask in comments. I will answer you. Have a nice day.